Pluto, the enigmatic dwarf planet residing at the farthest reaches of our solar system, is stirring curiosity within the cosmic community. Recent reports suggest a potential gravitational interaction between Pluto and Neptune, raising concerns among scientists and space experts. Prominent figures like Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have voiced warnings about the possible consequences of such an event. But how did Pluto end up in this precarious position? Despite these complicated dynamics, leading astrophysicists are expressing concerns over a potential collision between Pluto and Neptune. This situation raises questions, especially since such a scenario seems highly improbable given their vast distances. However, it is now becoming a topic of serious consideration among space experts. Neil deGrasse Tyson, a renowned astrophysicist, offers a fascinating perspective on the intricacies of our solar system, particularly with regard to Pluto. Famous for his role in reclassifying Pluto as a dwarf planet rather than a fully-fledged planet, Tyson provides insightful reflections on how our understanding of celestial mechanics continues to evolve. He views Pluto's reclassification not as a demotion, but as a testament to our expanding knowledge about the various objects orbiting the Sun. Tyson emphasizes that our approach to understanding space should involve constant learning and adaptation. He highlights the complexity of Pluto's orbit as a reminder of how much there is still to discover in the cosmos. Tyson believes that these intriguing questions fuel the public's fascination with astronomy, making Pluto's odd trajectory an opportunity to engage people in the wonders of the universe. He also cautions that events like Pluto's unusual orbit or possible collisions offer a chance to capture public imagination and interest in space science. Tyson, along with other experts, continues to warn about the dangers posed by Pluto's erratic orbit. After extensive study, Tyson has raised concerns about the three-body problem, a complex dynamic involving multiple gravitational interactions, which he suggests could pose a real threat. He believes a collision between Pluto and Neptune is long overdue, and such an event could have profound consequences, potentially even affecting Earth. The sheer amount of energy released by such a collision could shatter Pluto due to its smaller size, and the cold debris from the impact might scatter across the solar system, posing potential hazards to other planets and their moons. For Neptune, an impact of this scale could significantly alter its atmosphere and orbit, depending on the specific details of the event. Michio Kaku, a distinguished theoretical physicist known for his work in string theory, offers a unique perspective on this scenario. His views on space exploration and the connection between celestial mechanics and theoretical physics provide valuable insights into phenomena like Pluto's orbit. Kaku sees the study of Pluto and its orbit as a glimpse into the future of space exploration. Understanding the intricate gravitational interactions and orbital dynamics of celestial bodies like Pluto can provide crucial information for future space missions. According to Kaku, these insights can help scientists explore the outer solar system more effectively, anticipate potential hazards, and plan missions to the furthest reaches of our planetary neighborhood and beyond. Kaku also emphasizes that the lessons learned from studying Pluto's orbit can be applied to exploring other celestial bodies creating a framework for understanding distant worlds. He often highlights the connection between planetary physics and theoretical physics, particularly in relation to string theory. He believes that the movements and interactions of planets, such as the gravitational dance between Pluto and Neptune, are connected to the fundamental principles of physics. Kaku's work in string theory, which seeks to describe the fundamental forces and matter in the universe, suggests that studying the complexities of celestial mechanics, like Pluto's orbit, could offer insights into the fundamental laws of the universe. Like Tyson, Kaku has also addressed the potential consequences of a Pluto-Neptune collision, relating it to his theories about the cosmos. If such an event were to occur, it would be a monumental occasion in astronomy, providing a rare observational opportunity that could advance our understanding of string theory. String theory, a theoretical framework proposing that particles are actually one-dimensional strings, aims to explain the fundamental forces and matter in the universe. A collision of this scale in the solar system could create extreme conditions of energy and gravity, offering insights into the behavior of fundamental particles and forces under such circumstances, a key focus of string theory. Furthermore, 
the gravitational waves generated by the impact could provide crucial data for testing predictions related to gravity and spacetime within the framework of string theory. While the immediate impact on Earth would be minimal due to our distance from the outer solar system, the implications of such an event could be significant. It might enhance our understanding of the fundamental nature of the universe, as described by string theory and other areas of theoretical physics. Pluto's orbit serves as a striking example of celestial mechanics, demonstrating both stability and chaos within our solar system. The peculiar characteristics of its orbit, influenced by the gravitational forces of neighboring planets, especially Neptune, understood the complex and dynamic nature of space. The universe is full of mysteries, and the three-body problem is just one of them. Other potential cosmic catastrophes may be lurking. While the odds of planets colliding in space are extremely low, the possibility is not entirely out of the question. The way planetary orbits are affected by various factors, including gravitational interactions, is explained by the three-body problem. In some star systems like TRAPPIST-1, which has seven Earth-sized planets, gravitational forces create a rhythmic pattern called orbital resonances. These patterns can make planetary orbits less stable, potentially leading to collisions. Despite the crowded nature of systems like TRAPPIST-1, no collisions are currently occurring. Experts closely monitor these systems to understand how planets influence each other's orbits, especially when they are near one another. This information helps us better understand planetary movements in space. Rogue planets, drifting through space without orbiting a star, add an additional unpredictable element. These planets, once part of a star system, are ejected due to gravitational disturbances or other cosmic events, such as the close passage of another star or dynamic instability in their original systems. Over time, these wandering planets can travel vast distances, potentially arriving in regions far from their origin. During their solitary journeys, there is a slight chance that rogue planets might encounter other star systems. If one of these rogue planets enters a nearby solar system, there is a small possibility the likelihood of a collision of a with a rogue planet, planet in that system. directly affecting However, another planet. Given the vastness is exceedingly of space, low. However, such an event what remains such a highly improbable. anomaly mean for us on Earth? Let's explore this unfolding event. Once classified as a major planet, Pluto was later redefined as a dwarf planet due to its unusual orbit. Despite this change, Pluto continues to fascinate astronomers. Recent estimates from leading scientists have highlighted a close proximity between Pluto's orbit and that of Neptune, raising concerns about a potential collision between the two planets. This has sparked discussions about the possible risks it might pose to Earth. Pluto's orbit around the Sun is unique, taking approximately 248 years to complete a full revolution. Since its discovery in 1930, Pluto has yet to finish a complete orbit. Adding to its intrigue is the highly elliptical shape of its path, a stark contrast to the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. Furthermore, Pluto's orbit is inclined at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane, making its trajectory more erratic compared to other planets. One of the most notable aspects of Pluto's orbit is its crossing with Neptune's path for about 20 years in each revolution. During these times, Pluto travels closer to the Sun than Neptune, defying assumptions based on their respective positions within the solar system. So why hasn't there been a collision between Pluto and Neptune? The explanation lies in the gravitational influences exerted by various planets. The study of Pluto's orbit began shortly after its discovery, posing a significant challenge for astronomers. Unlike most planets whose orbits lie relatively close to the ecliptic plane, Pluto's orbit features a steep inclination and an elongated shape. The mystery deepened with the realization that Pluto's orbit crosses Neptune's. However, the stability of Pluto's orbit amidst these complexities is a testament to the intricate nature of celestial mechanics. The three-body problem in space, which involves understanding the motion and gravitational interactions among three celestial bodies, such as Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, explains the complex interplay of their orbits and gravitational forces. Terms like apsidal libration, latitude libration, and VZK effect further help unravel this cosmic puzzle. Astrophysicists believe that libration, responsible for maintaining planetary orbits, plays a crucial role in Pluto and Neptune's case. 
This term indicates that when Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is positioned about 90 degrees away from Neptune, effectively preventing potential collisions. Latitude libration ensures that when Pluto approaches Neptune or other giant planets, it is located significantly above their orbital plane, providing an additional layer of protection against impacts. The VZK effect explains why Pluto's orbit around the Sun appears erratic but remains stable over time despite seeming randomness in space. In the late 1980s, mathematical simulations revealed that, despite its unpredictable properties, Pluto's orbit is indeed chaotic. Minor initial deviations can lead to significant differences over long periods. However, Pluto's unusual orbit maintains stability over extremely long time scales, keeping chaos in check. Recent virtual simulations have improved our understanding of how giant planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn influence Pluto's orbit around the Sun-Neptune's unique relationship with Pluto. Completing three orbits for every two of Pluto's adds to the stability of Pluto's orbit. Additionally, Jupiter's immense gravity exerts a significant influence, while Saturn's smaller effect also plays a role. Through rigorous studies, experts have shown that the combined effects of Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn ensure the safe and stable evolution of Pluto in space for billions of years. These phenomena are crucial for maintaining the order and consistency of celestial motions in the universe. Without these factors, the solar system would be prone to greater instability and unpredictability, potentially leading to collisions or disruptions in planetary orbits, which could cause cascading effects on other celestial bodies. Understanding Pluto's orbit is especially critical in discussions of a possible future collision with Neptune. This information provides clearer insights into the dynamic nature of the solar system. Pluto's case highlights how seemingly unstable orbits can achieve stability through the complex interplay of gravitational forces and orbital mechanics. Continued observation and analysis of these phenomena are essential for gaining a better grasp of our position in the universe. Exploring the depths of space often reveals the elusive nature of celestial bodies. Moreover, Pluto's orbit serves as a prime example of this unpredictability. The concept of orbital chaos particularly illustrates the sensitive dependence of a celestial body's path on its initial conditions. As demonstrated in Pluto's case, even slight variations in the dwarf planet's position or velocity can significantly alter its long-term orbit. Computational simulations have been instrumental in helping researchers understand how Pluto moves in space. By making minor adjustments in these simulations, astronomers can observe how small changes can have significant effects on Pluto's trajectory. In the late 1980s, these simulations uncovered a fascinating aspect of Pluto's orbit. Despite features like apsidal libration and latitude libration contributing to its stability, Pluto's orbit can still exhibit unpredictability. Even a slight initial difference in Pluto's position or velocity can lead to vast changes in its path over many years. Nevertheless, this inherent chaos, Pluto's orbit remains stable over extremely long time scales, extending over billions of years. This suggests that beneath its seemingly inconsistent appearance, Pluto's journey around the Sun follows an underlying order. Predicting significant events, particularly for planets like Pluto, which have unusual orbits, is challenging. The inherent unpredictability of these systems makes long-term forecasts uncertain. Mathematical simulations help us understand and anticipate the future paths of celestial bodies, but they also reveal the limitations of our predictive capabilities. These models heavily rely on accurate initial conditions and simulate complex interactions. Even a small error can lead to fundamentally different outcomes, making precise predictions difficult. The chaotic nature of celestial orbits, like Pluto's, reminds us of the ever-changing universe. While we have made strides in understanding space, Pluto's case underscores our still limited knowledge. The vastness of interstellar distances and the rarity of planets in open space act as barriers to frequent collisions. Furthermore, rogue planets are relatively rare compared to the number of stars and planets in stable orbits, making such events even less likely. Understanding the gravitational influences of giant planets on Pluto's orbit provides significant insights into the broader dynamics of the solar system.
It shows how the presence and position of each planet can affect the stability and trajectory of other bodies in the system. Pluto, the enigmatic dwarf planet residing at the outer edges of our solar system, has been stirring excitement in the cosmic neighborhood. Recent reports suggest a potential interaction with Neptune, raising concerns among experts and space enthusiasts alike. Prominent scientists including Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku have issued warnings about the possible consequences of this intriguing encounter. The situation raises questions about how Pluto ended up in this precarious alignment. Despite the complex gravitational forces at play, leading astrophysicists are expressing concerns about a potential collision between Pluto and Neptune, although such an event seems unlikely given the complexities of their orbits. Nonetheless, this has become a topic of significant interest. Neil deGrasse Tyson, a well-known astrophysicist, offers insightful perspectives on the mysteries of our solar system, particularly regarding Pluto. Tyson, who gained fame for reclassifying Pluto as a dwarf planet instead of a full-fledged planet, continues to engage in discussions about the implications of such cosmic events.